Hello and welcome to Cupcakes. In this video I'm going to show you how I created these new baby cupcake toppers. I will be using a variety of different items. I have some fondant in a few different colours. I have some gold luster dust, a black edible pen, a sharp knife, a dressing tool and a balling tool, a mini letter stamp, a textured rolling pin and a standard rolling pin. I've also a variety of different shapes and size cutters, a few different size circle cutters, water and a paintbrush, some icing sugar to stop the fondant from sticking, a bow mould and an impression mat and a spare mat just for me to rest my cupcake toppers on. For the first two cupcake toppers I rolled out some pale blue and white fondant, cut out a nice fancy shape in both and with the mini letter stamps I created the word twinkle twinkle and on the other we used little star. And taking some of that yellow fondant I then rolled that out nice and thin, cut out two tiny stars for each of the toppers and used a balling tool just to make some indentations and pop in some edible gold pearls. After neatening the edges, I just popped these to one side. For the next two cupcake toppers, I rolled out pink and blue fondant. I used the impression mat, used the frill side of the circle cutter and imprinted the word baby on both. Again, I'm just using some letter stamps. For the next two cupcake toppers, I rolled out pink and blue again rolled out two smaller circles of yellow and using the small circle cutter I took a little bit away to create a moon effect and using the small part of my balling tool just gave that moon some texture. Attaching it with a little bit of water and either rolling out a thin piece of the white fondant or using some royal icing like I did I just created some little strands coming from the top of the moon with a little bit of a bow and taking two more small stars again in that yellow fondant and just attaching them. Again when I was happy with them I just put them on that board to the side and let them set. For the next cupcake toppers I rolled out some blue fondant and used my impression mat again and used the frill side of the circle cutter. Rolled out some of the pale pink fondant, using the bigger star cutter, cut out two stars and attached them to both the blue toppers using a little bit of water. I gave the star a few facial features by pressing the balling tool in to create some indentations for eyes. You can use a dressing tool or the bottom side of a straw to create a mouth. I added two tiny pieces of black fondant for the eyes, two tiny pieces of dark pink fondant for the cheeks, used the black edible pen to create eyebrows and attached two yellow bows. For the next two toppers I have some pink fondant rolled out with the impression mat being used and taking the pale blue fondant I rolled over that with the impressioned rolling pin, cut out two baby girl shapes and attached two large bows of yellow to the front. To make the bows I just simply push in some icing sugar into the mould, push down on the fondant, taking the sharp knife remove any excess off the top and gently just fold them bows back out. For the next two cupcake toppers I have pink and blue again with the impression mat being used. I wanted these two toppers to have a cloud on them but I don't have a cloud cutter so I took a flower cutter, left that white fondant quite thick and just cut out two flowers and using my fingers just pushing them down a little bit and taking that rolling pin to flatten them to a shape I was happy with. And just attaching them to the pink and blue topper with a little bit of water and then using my small balling tool again to create two little eyes and that straw to create the mouth. Popping a little bit of water into each of them indentations for eyes, I rolled in a small piece of black fondant into each. Again using the black edible pen to create some eyebrows. I then attached a yellow bow to each and decided to pop the one on the blue cupcake topper underneath, a bit like a dicky bow. I gave them both some cheeks with that pale pink fondant, just by adding two small balls. And when I was happy with these, I popped them on that board too. 
to finish the cupcakes, every bit of yellow fondant and every word, I mixed some gold luster dust with some vodka and painted over every bit of yellow and every word. After I'd done that, I left these on the board to firm up a little bit while I went and baked the cupcakes and made some buttercream. When I piped the buttercream onto the cupcakes, I left it quite flat and then gently just picking up each topper and popping them in place, gently pushing them into that fresh buttercream. There we have it, 12 cute new baby cupcake toppers. Thank you very much for watching.